Hello lads and ladies and welcome back for another video on the channel. Today we are back. Now we're doing something a little bit different. Normally on this channel we see us looking at League 1 or League 2. And I don't kind of sit back enough and say, look, I like this club. You know, I've, I've liked going to this club and, you know, this club do this well. I don't really like this about this club. Now, in this video we are going to rank the 92 football clubs on stadium. How much kind of I've liked my trips there kind of the rivalries with Fleetwood maybe, talk you through some of my experiences with the club. Look, not everyone can be and I absolutely love everyone. And if I'm honest with you, I don't hate any football club. I'm a lover, not a fighter. You'll see by the categories when we get into it. So I'm just going to rank the clubs from five different categories and they are down below. Love, like, admire, no feeling and meh. So they are the different categories, really, that we've got currently. So we're going to go through it. Let us know if you like this sort of stuff in the comments down below. If you do, let us know we'll do more of it. And if you don't, my channel, so you can't really do much about it. I'm joking. Um, again, this is your channel. We've got so much more content coming this year as well. So drop me a like. Can we go for 150 likes? That'd be massively appreciated. And let's get on with it. Accrington Stanley. There has been a bit of rivalry with Fleetwood. I admire what they've done through the non-leagues, unlimited money, and Andy Holt's done a good job there. But if I'm honest with you, it's not meh. There's no real feeling with Accrington because they are a rival of Fleetwood. It's It should be in meh, but I actually admire how they've done it and come up um, as well. Uh, AFC Bournemouth, although that isn't their badge... Um, Again, no real feeling. You might get a gist of this. Look, they've done really well to get to the Premier League, but it's like, meh. Wimbledon, I actually admire them, what they've been through. I think they're a great club. I love the new stand, uh, the new ground. Um, it looks really nice. I've been once before we drew 2-2. And I always like uh, playing AFC Wimbledon. Arsenal, I'm not a massive fan of Arsenal. Now, I've got Tottenham in my family, so that doesn't help feelings really but Arsenal down there Villa great club historic club with lots of history I'm gonna go in like you know I do like Villa Barnsley again I admire there's a load of clubs that I admire I love Oakwell I think Oakwell is that sort of ground where you've got a great cop behind the goal where the atmosphere comes from in far corner. Then you've got like a really nice modern stamp to your left. The away end's massive, so it suits for all knees. Like if you're a smaller club, it's, you go into a big ground. And if you're a big club, you get a 4,000, 500, 5,000 allocation. It should be five and five and a half. But, you know, please, when they get all of it, they, they like limiting it and limiting fun. And then on the right hand side, you've got the old stamp, which is there like, People will take the mick out of, but I really like. So I really like Oakwell. Really like him as a football club. Great support. They get taking the mickey at them a little bit, but I don't see that. I think they've got a great fan base. And you can see different things in Barnsley um, when you're there as well. Good club. Barrow, again. Um, and between Met and No Feeling, I'll go No Feeling because, like, Meant to be rivals with Fleetwood, but we've, we've hardly played them in the league, really, in recent years as well. So that might change this year as well. Birmingham, again, no real feeling. Um, great fan base. Um, look, if you're no feelings, I don't hate you. I don't hate anyone, really, bar these ones down below. Arsenal. I'm joking, Arsenal fans. Um, yeah, meh. meh um, no feeling, really. Blackburn, again, I've been to Ewood Park um, before feeling. Blackpool, it's difficult, isn't it? Um, look, I've got family um, who follow Blackpool, and I did go to a few Blackpool games when I was younger, but realistically, it's like, meh. Do you know what I mean? It's like, I don't like playing Blackpool. I don't like going to Bloomfield Road because they always beat us. Bolton, great club. Great fan base. Really, really like them. Um, Bradford, Again, I admire them. Big football club. And the only reason that they have the budget they do is because of the fan base that they've got and the season tickets that they sell. Um, they wouldn't be at this level, you know, for you know, realistically, they're self-sustainable, aren't they? And without the fan base, where would they be? 
Brentford, for some always reason, I've always admired Brentford. I've always liked them. I used to love it when they were at the old Griffin Park more. You know, there was a pub on every corner and I never actually went, which is gutting. But it felt old school when they were down in like the Championship League One and League, I think they were down in League Two at one point. Yeah. Brighton. It just feels very, I don't know. I'm like, yeah, Brighton are on. I'm like, yeah, they've done very well for themselves. But yeah, Bristol City, no real feeling. Bristol Rovers, I'll go above them. No real feeling, but they are a great fan base. Bromley, no real feeling. Burnley, always like my trips to Turf Moor. I've been to Turf Moor 10 times. Burton, like Fleetwood, but again, no real feeling. And again, you'll see this. If there's no real feeling, it's like, I don't like you. Uh, well, not that I don't like you. I admire what you've done. You've done well for different things. But it's not like I really admire you. Like, I, I really want to go to your stadium and play you. And it's like, it's just one of those, really. Uh, take it in good spirits. Because I know there's some people that won't. Cambridge, no real feeling. Cardiff. <sighs> I've got no feeling again. I've, I want to go to, to Cardiff at, at one stage. Uh, lots of football ground. Um, Billy Joel's actually on in um, Cardiff, I believe, as well. Get me there. Carlisle. And between these two, I'll go no feeling because uh, I like going Brunton Park. Charlton, love the valley, but again, no real feeling as well. Chelsea, with the Spurs connection. My, my actual uncle supports Chelsea, so I'll go in no feeling because he'll kill me otherwise. Cheltenham, Josh talks football. I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll put you there for you. Chesterfield, great football club. I'm buzzing to go to Chesterfield away as well. Colchester, I love Danny Cowley. Never been to Colchester away. Only played him, I think, maybe six or seven times. Uh, Coventry, like, I really like Coventry. Great football club, will live and die in these towns. Really, really like them. I think it's a um, fantastic football club, great fan base, unlucky at Wembley, got good mates who support them as well. Uh, I, re- I always root for Coventry. So see, if that's only happened in the last two or three years. I think they've got a great fan base. Crawley, I admired what they did last year, so I'm going to put them in there. Crew, no real feeling. Palace, great fan base, no real feeling though. Derby, uh, no feeling really. Tony wouldn't be happy if I put him anywhere up there. Put him up there just for you, Tony, in love. Doncaster, like Doncaster, but again, not enough to go and admire. Everton, I've always admired Everton. I think they're a great club. I think, I hope they don't lose the Everton spirit, the spirit of the Blues when they leave Goodison Park because I feel that Goodison Park, the way the ground has just won them so many points over the last few years, important points. I think they're winning against Palace when they won 3-2, was it? The Goodison Park that night was electric. I've been, mm, how many times have I been? I think four or five times. Really like Goodison Park. Uh, Exeter, some of these badges are a bit outdated, aren't they? Christ. Uh no real feeling. Fleetwood. Oh, man. Come on, the kids. Look, love him, you know. Um, I obviously did go and, you know, to many games as a kid. And it took me a while to find a home. And I never really felt at home anywhere else when I was a kid watching football. I found a home at Fleetwood when I was a young boy. And I've loved it ever since. Look, these... these Idiot, sometimes. They, they put me through a ringer and st- on the Saturday, I'm going, I don't like football. I'm not going next season, but I'll be there. Uh, Fulham. <sighs> no real feeling. No, why is he not dragging? Come on. Gillingham, again, no real feeling. But again, I love the rain amend. Um, Gillingham away, old special plated in my heart when we beat them 3-2. Grimsby. I was actually speaking to some uh, lads from Grimsby the other day. Kyle, uh, shout out to you, mate, as well. Uh, we'll put out no feeling. I'm looking forward to playing them on the opening day. Harrogate, I really like what Simon Weaver's done there, but again, no real feeling. Huddersfield, admire. Now, I went to Huddersfield, Birmingham in 2016-17 and came away loving their fan base. They got promoted that year. And ever since, I've always wanted Huddersfield to do well. And in one way, I'm gutted they've come down, but in another way, I'm buzzing I can cover them. Uh, Hull City, I don't know what it is, but I just like the way they do things and the way they operate and the play that they got, like, obviously, Louis Coyle's been there as well. That, you know, and they've just had so many good players that they've developed in recent years as well. And since you come down to League One, we got to cover them for a, a season. Uh, I think we actually played them five times that season, didn't we? We played them in the FA Cup. 
played him in the Papa John's and then twice in the league as well. So uh, we played him, I think we played him three times away that year. I didn't get to go to any of them. Great. Um, Ipswich, like Ipswich, really do. Um, great club and oh, their fan base was immense with me. Like a lot of this is how fan bases are with me on here. So if you put me a nice comment in, you know, you could easily get promotion. It's a bit like your workplace. You just got to find your way in, haven't you? Um, so we'll go with like Leeds United. I've got to admire them. The fan base they've got is unbelievable. I think sometimes that can be the detriment where the pressure's too much on the players and as a club, they set their own expectations. But when Leeds come calling, you want to go, don't you? Leicester, I admire the way they won the Premier League, but no real feeling towards him. Leighton Orient, no real feeling. Good football club, though. Lincoln City, yeah. Have that, Jake. No, I'm sorry. I've got to go up here. Um, if I'm honest with you, if you asked me about five years ago, that is just by having good friends that support Lincoln. Sue, I can't think of anyone else, but uh, yeah, Sue is, uh, Sue is, I, I just want to make this known that Sue has definitely not made me shortbread in terms of that ranking. But um, yeah, no, Lincoln, great football club, underrated fans at home. When it's going, it's electric in that far out and corner near the away fans, and they pack it out like seven, eight thousands. And, um, that they're going and they, 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 you know they've gone from the National League, League Two, and League One, and they're, they're sustained in League One now. And when you look at typical League One club, you think Lincoln because on size of fan base, away fan base, performances, players, they're a, they're a steady League One club, but ambitious that they want more. And I really like that. Um, Lincoln City, great club, and you know, hopefully, we get to a few of their games, although we won't be in the same league. Liverpool. I hate doing this, but I actually really admire Liverpool and want them to do well. I don't know why, but yeah. Luton, no, did they go with no feeling? I think they did. There we are. Man City, I can't put admire with the amount of money they put in, but I like going to the Etihad. I really like the Etihad. Man United, mm, no feeling, because I don't mind watching United, but it's like, yeah. Mansfield, no real feel. I've only ever been to one. Uh, one of my first games actually for Fleetwood was when Fleetwood beat Mansfield 5 4. I think they had the Sam Kalukas actually scored for them that day as well. He went on to, you know, uh, big things in the championship, didn't he? Um, I think he played for Hull. Um, Middlesbrough, again, connections within the family to them. So I've always wanted them to do well. So I'm going to put Admire. But like, this isn't in order, by the way. Millwall. Again, I admire them. I like Millwall. Uh, Milton Keynes, no real feeling. Morecambe, meh. But again, one thing I like about Morecambe is the spirit, that they are that club that always do well and against the odds. I really like Derek Adams, and I feel like I'm one of the only ones who does this. But, yeah, I think that definitely Morecambe there. Um, Newcastle, no real feeling. Newport, no feeling. Northampton, no feeling. Um, Norwich, bit meh. Um, Notts Forest, that's for you, Tony. No, uh, uh, admire. Uh, Notts County, no feeling. But again, great football club. I think a lot of these will change because I like Notts County. We've not played Notts County for years, so we need to see these clubs. In action, really, and then we'll then we'll see. Um, Oxford, no real feeling. Uh, Peterborough, I like the way they ran. I like the business model. Plymouth, admire them. I like them. Love Home Park. Port Vale, again, admire uh, Vale as well. Good club. No, I. It only has to be Fleetwood in there, but we'll put you there. Tell you what. We'll just move a couple of these around. But, uh, yeah. Um, play at Pompey. Come on, the boys. Um, great club. Preston. Because I went to uni there, and that's changing. And they're, they're local to me on the map. Again, it's like Morecambe. They're not a rivalry of Fleetwood. It's weird. We've got a weird relationship with Preston because it's like 
we hate Blackpool too as a fan base. Now, I don't really hate anyone, but it's like, you hate Blackpool, we hate Blackpool, let's, you know, let's kiss, let's hug. But like, yeah, I, I don't mind Preston. QPR, no real feeling. Reading, the same. Rotherham, the same. Salford, now I've been to a lot of Salford games over the years, and that's because we've had Pondy, McElhenney, Ken, so, you know, my good mate. Uh, no, I love Kenzie, and obviously I've always wanted Salford to do well watching the documentaries. I'll get stick for this, but I'm putting Salford in there. I actually really like them because they've just done what Fleet would have done. They put money in, and people are jealous because they want that themselves. Sheffield United, admire them. Greasy chip butty, wow. And we've, I don't know if I've mentioned it, but Fleet would won twice at Bramall Lane. Wednesday, really like Wednesday. They're fantastic with me. Um, I'd say. Wednesday, Lincoln, Pompey, Ipswich, and Bolton, and one other club that is coming, have been the best five or six clubs with me since starting YouTube. Look, there's been a lot of good clubs that have been fine with me. Shrewsbury, no feeling. Nah. I'm a blue. Can't have that. Um, Stevenage, no real feeling, but... Big goalie. No, actually, I'm going to go into Admire just for Matt Farley. Stockport, Admire, like Stockport County a lot. Stoke, no real feeling, but again, great club. Um, Sunderland, Admire them, I really do. Uh, Swansea, no feeling. Swindon, no real feeling. Spurs, because of the family connections, I'm going to have to put them in like. I always want Spurs to do well. Like, I follow England, Fleetwood and Spurs. We don't win much, do we? Come on. Um, Tramia, great club, Tramia. Uh, and where they are with Everton and Liverpool around the corner, they do well to get what they are. Walsall, see the ground every week. Uh, Watford, meh. I'm sick of them sacking managers, to be fair. Uh, West Brom, meh. Uh, West Ham, meh. I used to love them when they were at Upton Park. Wigan. Right, Wigan. Great club. Friendly. Whoa! That's too far. Down there. Um, yeah, great club, Wigan. Uh, Wigan have scored! Wigan have scored! That, that came from there. Uh, it wasn't my proudest moment. I said he won! I said he won! Put it that way, but yeah, I really like Wigan as a fan base. Wolves. Wrexham. Oh, I admire the fans that were there before. And people who slag them off are just jealous. Look, I think good luck to them. Um, I don't think the owners will get bored. I think people will just say that. But, yeah, they've done well. And Wickham, you know something? They beat us in the playoffs. But I do admire them, and I loved it when they had Gareth Ainsworth. Um, so that is it. That is it. As you can see, Fleetwood I love. Like is Lincoln City, Portsmouth, Ipswich, Wednesday, Villa. Coventry, Spurs, Bolton, Salford, Wigan. There's a lot in Admire, then there's too many in No Feeling. And the clubs down here in May, if I'm honest with you, Arsenal is only because of the Spurs connection, and they just annoy me because they always were better, better than the Spurs growing up. Blackpool is because they always beat us, and I'm fed up of it. And I cried at Bloomfield Road when they beat us about seven years ago. Brighton is just May. Morecambe, you know something? I would bring them up. But I don't want to get abused. But I actually, you know, don't mind Morecambe too much. Norwich and Watford and Southampton are just like meh. But they are myself. They are my rankings. Let us know if you enjoy it. Please like the video if you haven't already. Subscribe for more. And until next time, I will see you later. Thanks very much for watching.